Good morning, boys and girls. I'm so excited to introduce you to a new student. Class, meet Daisy. Whatever. Wait, hasn't Daisy been here before? Well, I'm pretty sure I recognize Daisy. She was the one going, Daisy doesn't want to be here. Still don't. Yes, I should have said reintroduce Daisy. She came here once, but didn't come back again after that. Now her people have convinced her to give it another try. And I'm not going to like it. But how do you know that? You haven't even given it a chance. Shows what you know. I already did try it. Well, you came for one day, but you certainly didn't try. Yeah, I remember. You just kept saying, Daisy doesn't want to be here. Class, say hello to Daisy. Daisy doesn't want to be here. Daisy doesn't want to be in this class. Daisy doesn't want to do school. Ew, I remember that. It fried my whiskers. It was so annoying. That's not giving it a try? Nope, not at all. Duh, I was there, wasn't I? You have to do more than just be there. Just because you show up doesn't mean you tried. Teacher, maybe seeing the principal will help her. Yeah, she needs to see the principal. Principal? Principal Cool Cat? No, Daisy needs to see Unity Principal number three. You know, Unity Principal number three that says we create our experiences by the way we think about things. Oh, that kind of principal. Principal number three says I create my experiences by what I choose to think and what I feel and believe. I don't get it. Well, it's like this. I was really afraid to try this class, but I held in mind that my mommy said that it was a good place, so I gave it a try. And now I'm here enjoying this instead of hiding under the couch. Like we cats believe that we are kings and queens, and therefore our peoples treat us like royalty. My mommy was eating this thing called a nanner, and, and I looked at it and said, Ew, that yucky. And she said, No, yummy. Here, try some. And I said, Ew, uh, okay, I'm going to give it a try. And I did, and it was so yummy, and now I have a new favorite food. It's all in your attitude. Do you choose to look at it as something that could be good, or do you already decide it's yucky? We can choose to create our world with a positive attitude, or we can choose to create our world with a negative attitude. And that choice makes such a difference in the way you experience your world. <sighs> I think I get it. By having a bad attitude, I'm keeping myself from discovering whether I really could like this or not. Okay, for the next few classes, I'm going to give it a try. That's wonderful. While Daisy is focusing on principle number three, let's do it too. For homework tonight, let's all take a look at our lives and find an area where we can make better choices on what we choose to think, believe, and feel. We'll discuss it tomorrow. For now... Class dismissed.